Welcome to SunPower Equinox Pro Tips. This video will demonstrate how to properly terminate Equinox Type E circuits. For the purposes of this demo, we'll assume Invisimount rails have been installed, along with the rail mounted J box with home run conduit plus conductors or UF cable circuits, and the checklist with photos has been completed. The tools and materials you'll need include two pair of adjustable pliers, a razor knife, and a pair of lineman's pliers a trunk cable, a terminator assembly, and a zero degree cable management clip. Let's get started. You must terminate and seal at least one end of the trunk cable on each branch circuit. Determine where the last module in your circuit is located. For the purposes of this video, circuits begin at the junction box and end at the terminator assembly on the last module. Use the lineman's pliers to cut the trunk cable. Leave enough cable length so that after the terminator is added to the trunk cable end, you are still able to support the terminated cable along the edge of the module frame with a cable management clip. Unscrew the compression net from the terminator assembly and use one side as a guide to strip half an inch of the black outer sheathing from the cut end of the trunk cable, exposing the black and red conductor wires. Be very careful not to cut into the insulation of the black and red conductors. Place the compression nut over the trunk cable with its threads facing away from the trunk cable. Slightly separate the exposed black and red conductors and push them into the terminator assembly, making sure the trunk cable is fully seated in the assembly. The two conductors will be separated by a pin inside the terminator. Ensure that you align the trunk cable with the terminator and carefully insert the black and red conductors smoothly. Tighten the compression nut onto the terminator assembly using one set of adjustable pliers to hold the terminator assembly and the other set of adjustable pliers to tighten the compression nut. Do not tighten the terminator itself. Hold the end of the terminator with one pair of pliers and then tighten only the hex nut with the other pair. Twisting the trunk cable could result in terminator malfunction. Terminators are single-use components. If you loosen the hex nut after tightening it, you must discard the terminator and use a new one. Now carefully secure the trunk cable along the edge of the module frame using one or more zero-degree cable management clips. Make certain that the cable is not in direct contact with the roof. And with that, you have successfully terminated your Type E circuit. Thanks for watching the SunPower Equinox Pro Tips video. To learn more, check out the video description below for links to helpful resources and other training videos.